Hey friends, welcome back to Storytime with Brett. Have you been outside today? It is absolutely pouring down rain. I found a book that I thought would be perfect for today because it's called The Rain Came Down and it's by one of my absolute favorite authors, David Shannon. Are you ready to get started? The Rain Came Down. On Saturday morning, the rain came down. It made the chickens squawk. The cat yowled at the chickens and the dog barked at the cat. And still, the rain came down. The man yelled at the dog and woke up the baby. Stop all that yelling, shouted the man's wife. And the dog barked louder. Still, the rain came down. Oh my goodness. It's a lot of commotion going on in that house. A policeman heard the noise and stopped to see what was wrong. His car was blocking traffic. And half a block away, a woman squirmed in the back of a taxi. Hurry up or I'll miss my plane, she told the taxi driver. So he started honking his horn. The truck driver in front of him got mad and started honking back. I have tomatoes to deliver, he shouted. Oh boy, now everybody's arguing. The ice cream man heard the honking and turned up the music on his van. Jingle jangle went his music. Slappity slap went his windshield wipers, and still the rain came down. That's what it's like outside here. Just a bunch of noise. I hear ambulances. I hear people honking their horns. So much going on out there. The owner of the beauty parlor came out to see what all the fuss was about. She bumped into the barber coming out of his barber shop, and they began to argue. Up on his ladder, the painter grumbled. I can't paint in the rain. He started to climb down and bonked the barber in the head with his can of paint. Now, all three of them were arguing. Next, the baker stepped out of his bakery. My roof is leaking and my cakes are getting wet, he moaned. He opened his umbrella and poked the pizza man in the nose. So they joined the arguing too. A boy ran by chasing a small boat down the stream in the gutter. He splashed a little girl and she began to cry. And still the rain came down. Wow, it looks like everybody's kind of in a bad mood from the rain. The grocery man stomped out onto the sidewalk and yelled, where is the delivery truck? I need my tomatoes. He ran into a lady coming out of the clothing store and knocked her boxes into his fruit stand. Oranges, apples, and lemons bounced down the sidewalk and still the rain came down. What a mess. Oh man, I hope their day gets better. The policeman walked back to his car. What is all this ruckus about, he asked. The whole block was honking, yelling, fighting, and barking. And then, hmm, what do you think's gonna happen? Do you have a prediction? You remember that means to make a guess? And then, the rain stopped. And so did the noise. The sun came out, and the air smelled fresh and sweet, and everything shimmered and a rainbow stretched across the rooftops. If you look really hard in this picture, at the very, very top, you can see the rainbow. Can you see it up at the top? It's much too nice a day to be arguing, said the baker. I have cakes to bake, and I have pizzas to make, said the pizza man. I could use a shave while my building dries, said the painter to the barber. Then they went inside. Hmm. It seems like 
Everyone's getting along now. Maybe because the weather's nicer. The policeman said, everything looks A-OK -okay to me. And he drove off in his car. Look at the rainbow in his sunglasses. It's reflecting. Have you ever seen a rainbow? They're so beautiful. The woman in the taxi decided she had time to have her hair done before her trip. So she went into the bar beauty parlor. So the lady with the boxes got into the taxi and went home. The truck driver told the grocer, I have your tomatoes. Wonderful, said the grocer, but first I have to pick up this fruit. The little girl and boy helped him. So he bought them ice cream cones and the ice cream man gave them each an extra scoop because it was such a nice day. Yum, look at all that ice cream. Do you have a favorite ice cream flavor? Mine is mint chocolate chip and it looks like they have one of those scoops on their ice cream cone. Then the man, his wife, and their baby had a picnic together in the backyard while the dog, the cat, and the chickens slept in the warm afternoon sun. So that's the family from the very beginning that the dog was barking, the chickens were making sounds, the baby was crying, and now they look very happy. Isn't it funny how the weather can affect how we feel? Sometimes when it's raining, we feel kind of yucky, and then the sun comes out and we're happy. I hope that you like that story. I hope you'll subscribe and come back and see me soon. Bye, friends.